Hey everybody, welcome to VCD Tinkerbench. I'm your host, Drew. Wanted to make a quick video to cover how uh, do you clean the acrylic, right? So you ordered your uh, ID badge, your identification badge, and you wanted to uh, clean it off. Uh, I do send it with the protective layer on, on it, uh, both the front and the back. The back is gonna be the engraved portion of it. I do have a sample of one here. So as you can see, um, I have the front is nice and soft and smooth and the back is where it's all engraved. Uh, it's kind of hard to tell without touching it and being here in person, but you'll have to take my word for it. When you get it, you're gonna love it. I am actually working on little mini stands uh, that we may include, but um, it's really interesting. You just slide, <laughs> it's really interesting. You just slide them in, they sit at an angle and you just stand them up wherever you want to display them. So when you're not uh, actively walking around Batu or at a con, uh, wherever you are uh, at your home, you can have it on display along uh, like with the data pads. In the package, you're going to obviously get your ID card and you're going to get one of these orange plastic blades. Now, uh, it's plastic so that it doesn't scratch. There are some um, things that you do need to be aware of, right? So when you use one of these blades and you are scratching away at the paper on the back, you want to make sure that you don't scratch too long and do long strokes. You want it to kind of be short, stay over the area that you want to remove the paper from because if you do these long strokes, you are possibly gonna pick up some of the acrylic dust. And with that minute acrylic dust, you can accidentally actually scratch the acrylic. So without further ado, let's get started on this. All right, so we have the ID card right here in front of us. This is the fluorescent green. Um, we are going to be rotating the colors in and out as time moves on so like right now we're working on the clear uh, we're working on the fluorescent green but we have the clear and the blue in rotation so I'm gonna go ahead you grab the ID card uh, you're only gonna receive one blade and the best approach to anything when it comes to peeling these is to start off right on the corner so wherever there's a nice crisp corner to grab from, uh, I would suggest that. These are not as sharp of a corner. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna get started here on this corner. And I'm just gonna peel the first layer around the edge. So now you can see that nice fluorescent green color coming through. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and pick the next corner this is gonna be the crispiest corner. So I'm gonna start there. You could either use the blade or you could use your finger. Like I said, you find the, the nice corner that you can start at. If you don't get it the first time, you can try again with your nails. If you have a hard time with your nails, you can always use the uh, edge of the blade, for example, you can just pass it. And then I'll do like a slicing motion, but only this tip here is what's touching the ID. The rest of it is not touching the ID. So once I start, I just do a nice little slice motion and it comes right off. Light taps on a solid surface will help clear off some of the dust that gets left over. Uh, this looks really good. I don't see anything else stuck on here or inside the grooves. So at this point, we get to do the awesome reveal. Pick the corner, and peel it off. Look at that. There you go, look at that. That's my fluorescent green ID. 
So uh, this is actually, like I said, this is fluorescing. So I have a nice little black light here. There you go. So not many people know this. Um, the blue data pad. I use the same acrylic for the ID badges, uh, the, the ID tags. It also glows under a black light. So um, not many people know it. And like I said, it is a black light. So um, super cool. Now that the lights are back up. <laughs> now that the lights are back on, that's how easy it is. Um, you can either use the blade that we provide or you can use your fingernails if you have fingernails to uh, peel this off. Uh, as I mentioned, there are some things that you need to look out for. Uh, first things first, make sure you peel the back first. Do not peel the front first. What can happen is if you peel the front first, you put it down and you start peeling the back. As you're peeling, you can actually cause scratches to the front as it slides around the surface that you're using. Make sure um, you uh, don't do long strokes. So don't, um, if you're trying to peel something over here, don't go across the ID once you peel it off to try to get it off the ID card. It's fine if it stays on there as long as you peel it off wherever it was. You just pass your finger over it and brush it or blow it, one or the other. Hope you enjoy your new ID or I hope you consider getting one. Uh, they're really awesome to have. Thanks for watching.